What kind of people were your grandparents? I don't know. I never knew them. At home, it was forbidden to talk about him. Why? Well, I think he hated them. But after all, that madman hated everyone. What happened to them? Well, my grandmother disappeared when he was just a kid. Disappeared without leaving any trace. What about your grandfather? Oh, well, he drank. He drank a lot. He died a few years later, consumed by alcohol. But that's all I know. Not even my mother was allowed to talk about him. Yeah, I'll be out there. Yeah, I go, we sit down. Where you go again? Hurry, I can't hear you. Oh, Terry, oh, Terry. Oh, 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 daddy, get out of here. Who's the other guy? Yeah, toilet, load get toilet, he's the bar. Thirty meters. It's a Hmm, right to give you a bar. So, this is where you grew up. This is where his obsession with the painting began. Oh, come on, stop talking. Let me rest. We'll be leaving early for Linville tomorrow morning. Our investigations will start there. Good night, Arthur. Okay. Yeah, all right. Good night, Marty. Oh boy, you got a bed. Hmm. Twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty. I'm on my way, Timmy. It won't be difficult to find him. His favorite hiding places are on shelves and closets. Oi, not in the room.
बहुत ट्रेन के ऊपर चढ़ गया बच्चा नाइस नाइस घर में तो है नहीं भाई वो बाहर गया लगता है I found yeah. you. <laughs> I won. Now you have to tell me the secret. You promised. Okay, okay. I'll tell you everything. Then what's the secret? First, promise not to tell mom. Promise. Okay. I think I found out what's going on with dad. What do you mean? I know now why dad never stays with us and never plays with us. I know why he's always down there in the cellar. Because he has to work. Mom always says so. No, it's not a lie. Dad is a prisoner. They keep it locked in there. Them. Uh, them who? The monsters. I don't believe you. The monsters don't exist. Yeah, they exist. I've seen them. They stay in there with him and keep dad hostage. They hurt him. You went through the cellar? It's forbidden. How did you get in? There's another key. Dad's isn't the only one. And where? I put it back in its place in the attic. I was afraid that the monsters would notice someone had taken it. If the monsters did find out, they hurt dad. This is why dad doesn't want anyone to go in there. You're scaring me. How do I know it's it's not a lie? I'll show you. Jello. But but I'm afraid of monsters. No, don't be a kid, Marty. We have to help Dad before it's too late. We have to get him back. And how? I have a plan. start from by Frank Bundy the man Parkman suspects wouldn't it be better to give priority to what you saw in a dream it's not clear what I've seen not yet we will start from that man's bar we need more information about him then we will go to the place where Simon disappeared Elizabeth Barkley's villa isn't far from here Okay, boss. Hello? Mr. Burton, it's Thomas Barkley. Have you started your investigation? Yes, I'm at the gates of Linville. I'm approaching your suspect. Be careful, Mr. Burton. That man is dangerous. Don't worry. I know what I'm doing. If you run into any trouble, call me at this number. I'll send Charles to get you. Okay, thanks, Mr. Barkley. Hey, but where did Linville go? Uh, are we in the wrong place? I'm afraid not, Arthur. It is still happening.
careful, Marty. We don't know what awaits us. What's that noise? Is it something liquid? I don't like this place. Solution is in the paintings. Marty, hurry up. There's something in the oil. Something is coming towards us. Oh. Don't stop. 
Stop, Marty! Run!
Back? Uh, I think so. affected by the accident. It seems deserted. Many inhabitants must have abandoned it. How ugly to see the playground so deserted. Where are the children of Linville? Gases and vapors are carcinogenic, but the situation now seems to be under control. Mm, poor people. This is the place. Heavy shot bar. Is he here? It depends on who is looking for him. One who is on his side. I heard about the protests against Barkley. I want to join in the next protest. It's strange. I've never seen you around here. I moved here recently, but I have my reasons for being upset with that old jackal. The boss isn't here today. Do you have his contact details? Where can I find him? Dude, either you drink or go home. You know, you're the third person who comes here to ask about him in the past two days. You think my boss is a fool? You're really out of your mind. I don't think so. That's why I'm here. You're wasting your time. I don't leave out contact details, and I don't give information about my boss to strangers. If you care to meet him, come back in the evening. And if you're lucky, you may meet him. But I advise you, he's been very nervous lately. Everyone's been a little nervous on this island lately. Amanda? What the fu- I can't believe you're here. Let me buy you a drink. I thought you retired. Did. 
Sure. In summary, the worst ecological disaster of the past 20 years, the grandson of one of the richest and most detested men in the world who disappears without a trace, a civil revolt about to explode, and you are here at the Heavy Shop Bar on Quiet Island to have a drink. Okay, okay. But lower your voice. I'm working for Barkley. I'm looking for the kid. I knew you wouldn't give up. I give up. This life is no longer for me. Uh, don't talk nonsense. People need someone like you. Maybe it's me who no longer needs people. But you're here. So... Well, what about you? You're with Barkley, right? I'm here to shed light on the pipeline accident. Barkley and Petro Mobile squeezed this island like a lemon. Corruption, pollution, bad business. The situation has literally exploded. If Barkley is responsible for what happened, he should pay. Aren't you getting into something too big? Journalism is about spreading what someone doesn't want you to know. Everything else is just propaganda. I guess so. How about collaborating? Like old times. You help me nail Mr. Oil Man, I help you find the boy. <sighs> I don't know. I know you have your weird dreams, but I have the information and I can find it quickly. I need you and you need me, so what's the holdup? Okay, but nobody needs to know I'm here. Done deal, Mr. Dream Man. Now I have to go, but be careful, Marty. People on Quiet Island are strange. Who is it, after all?